Top 10 Space Discoveries Made by James Webb Telescope So Far The invention, launch, and operation of the James Webb Telescope have been a major milestone in scientific discovery for decades. Even though the telescope's first year of operation is the beginning, it has already contributed to many scientific discoveries. In today's video, we will look at the top 10 space discoveries the James Webb Telescope has made. Number 1. Stars and the Pillars of Creation The Pillars of Creation, situated in the Eagle Nebula, is one of the most iconic images taken by the predecessor of JWST, the Hubble Telescope. Due to the Hubble Telescope being able to detect mostly visible lights, it only captures the structure's impressive clouds, leaving out the creation happening within them. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope. With its mode of detecting infrared light, the telescope has captured the pillars of creation in several protostars. Appearing as tiny red dots in the smoky background of the pillars, these clusters of gas and dust, each many times larger than our solar system, are stars in the process of birth. According to Anton Kokmer, a research astronomer at the Space Telescope Science Institute in Baltimore, the image was built using different colors to represent mostly invisible infrared wavelengths. The only viable parts of the image appear blue. To us, they would appear red. The wavelengths of the colors also rise as the radiation rises, with red parts of the image, such as the protostars, emitting radiation about six times the wavelength a human eye can see. In addition to showing Webb's power as an infrared telescope, images like this could also help scientists understand how stars form, including our sun. Number 2. The Phantom Galaxy While the Phantom Galaxy is always buried deep in the night sky, making it extremely difficult to see, its brightness is far from invisible, especially when photographed with Webb's infrared camera. Hubble's optical view, also known as M74, shows the galaxy's beautiful spiral shape and its distribution of stars, arms spreading outward from a radiation center. However, a recent web image shows structures that resemble fibers made of heat-emitting dust and gas that emanate from a bright center rendered in vivid electric blue. The new image will illuminate the star-forming regions dispersed along the galaxy's spiral arms in infrared light. Number 3. Mysterious Boxy Ripples Surround the wolf Rayet Star in July, Webb took an image of a distant star called wolf Rayet Star, which featured Webb's signature diffraction pattern, an imaging artifact. However, researchers detected something mysterious in the image. Around the star, called WR140, is a pattern that looks unreal, a ripple-like pattern of concentric rings with an odd, slightly boxy shape. In contrast to the diffraction pattern, the strangely shaped rings are real features. Wolf Rayet stars are hot, massive stars in the late stage of their evolution. They are characterized by strong winds and emission lines in their spectra caused by the ejection of material from the star's surface. These features make Wolf Rayet stars relatively easy to identify. According to the astronomers at Noir Lab in Arizona, the strangely shaped rings affect the interaction of the WR140 with its smaller companion star. Number 4. Finding the Most Distant Galaxies Ever Webb was designed for viewing the universe's most distant galaxies. In mid-December, scientists announced that they had successfully done so. The telescope has officially observed the four most distant galaxies known, meaning they are also the oldest. Webb observed the galaxies as they first emerged some 13.4 billion years ago. The universe was just 350 million years old, almost 2% of its present age. Scientists believe the four galaxies are ancient, similar to the hundreds of other galaxies discovered by Webb. Researchers determined the galaxy's ages as part of the JWST Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey JADES. This process involves using information from the telescope's near-infrared spectrograph to determine how quickly the galaxies were moving away from the galaxy. The red shift of galaxies measured the lengthening of light waves caused by the universe's expansion. The highest red shift ever measured was 13.2 for them. Number 5. Detailed Detection of an Exoplanet Atmosphere a planet orbiting a star in the constellation Virgo is one of the most explored worlds outside our solar system, all thanks to the Webb Telescope. The planet called WASP-39b is about 700 light-years away from Earth. It is a hot Jupiter-type planet, 
meaning that it is a gas giant planet similar in size to Saturn. It orbits its host star at a ridiculously close distance, almost eight times closer to its host star than Mercury is close to the Sun. Using Webb's main camera and two spectrographs, scientists could detect carbon dioxide in its atmosphere. This discovery is the first time the gas has been found in an exoplanet's atmosphere. However, thick clouds containing sulfur and silicates, including sulfur dioxide, filled the planet's thick atmosphere. Researchers could use the knowledge from discovering carbon dioxide in the planet's atmosphere to infer aspects of its history and formation. Scientists think the star formed from a collision of smaller planetismals and has formed farther from its star than it is now. The evidence of this notion is that the planet has more oxygen than carbon in its atmosphere. Number 6. A Glimpse at Titan's Clouds Saturn's Titan is one of the most intriguing objects in the solar system, and it is the subject of many scientific studies. Titan is about 50% larger than the Earth's moon, and is the only known place other than the Earth where they discovered stable bodies of surface liquid. Titan is also known for its dense orange atmosphere, a hazy one dotted with methane clouds. Scientists saw some of those clouds in November, when Webb captured atmospheric data from the mysterious moon, at first they thought it was one cloud, but later discovered two clouds, including one above Kraken Mare, the moon's largest sea. The team was so fascinated that they reached out to Keck Observatory in Hawaii, which was able to study the Titan two days later. In the Keck observations, the cloud over Kraken Mare is there. Still, it is of a different shape, indicating that it either changed or another cloud moved into the same place. The team hopes using information like this will help them map Titan's haze and find new gases in the moon's atmosphere. Number 7. Brown Dwarfs with Sand Clouds While many telescopes have identified the exoplanets, the Webb telescope is not designed for this. But it did find some. One of them is VHS-1256b. This VHS-1256b isn't a planet per se. It's more like a brown dwarf, bigger than a planet but smaller than a true star. This brown dwarf emits a faint red glow due to the modified kind of fusion that happens on massive objects but is too small to fuse hydrogen. Even odder, Webb discovered that the brown dwarf has sand and silica clouds, which is unusual for an object of this kind. The exoplanet is also young and small for a brown dwarf. Like WASP-39b, Webb was able to identify specific chemicals in the strange atmosphere of the brown dwarf, including water, methane, carbon dioxide, and potassium. The ratios of the various components imply that the brown dwarf has an explosive atmosphere. Number 8. Discovery of the Southern Ring Nebula A Southern Ring Nebula is an interesting object for astronomers. Their notion was that a nebula is a dying star that has expelled its outer layer of gas and dust into spaces. Scientists also believed that a non-dying star, part of a binary system, was largely hidden by the brightly lit gas. But Webb's breathtaking image of the nebula, released as part of its first images and data, revealed that it wasn't as easy as that. With its near-infrared camera, an IR cam, and the mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, Webb captured an image of the cloud. With MIRI, researchers discovered that the white dwarf was not invisible in that wavelength as they had expected, but was glowing red and encircled by a haze of cool gas. Where did the gas originate? The only reasonable explanation, it seemed, was that the nebula hiding a third star was the source of the gas. The telescope's main camera also captured fascinating shells around the outer edges of the nebula, resembling those near WR140. They think that a third star located between the already identified two may be responsible for the ripple-like shells. Number 9. Hidden Star in Galaxy Collision as an infrared telescope, Webb can peer through dust revealing objects hidden by telescopes like Hubble, primarily using visible light. When Webb took an image of two galaxies colliding, the telescope saw something Hubble missed, which is an area of intensive star formation. Scientists claim that this area creates stars 20 times faster than our galaxy. In the image, there is an area of star formation in the merged galaxies called IC 1623. 
Infrared radiation makes the area shine so bright that it produces Webb's signature pointed star diffraction pattern, which is common when it observes bright stars. Number 10. A Not-So-Cloudless Planet The last top discovery of the Webb telescope on this list is the spectrum of an atmosphere of the WASP-96b exoplanet. Webb telescope obtained the spectrum using its spectrograph to analyze the light of the planet's star when crossing in front of the planet's atmosphere. The spectrum detected signs of cloudy skies, clouds, and water vapors on the planet. This finding is strange, considering that scientists previously believed the planet doesn't have any clouds because it has a strong sodium signal, indicating cloudless skies. The results are so contradictory that researchers have no choice but to reanalyze both Webb and the previous data to figure out a solution. From all these discoveries, which one do you find incredible the most? Let us know in the comment section. Also, if you haven't already, please click the like button and subscribe to the channel. We'll see you in the subsequent videos.